once we have our contour line drawing on our tracing paper, we will start by grabbing our masking tape and our sculpture wire. You will then decide where you want to start, grab your sculpture wire and start attaching it to the piece of tracing paper with some masking tape. You will also use your pliers in order to help you model and mold the wire in the shape that you want it to be. When you're using the pliers to mold your wire, just make sure that you have wrapped them a couple of times with masking tape so they do not create some sort of indents on your wire. This process might take a little bit of time, so you can also use your hands in order to set up the wire as you want it to be. Once you have it where you want it to be, just make sure that you grab some more masking tape and attach it to the piece of tracing paper so it does not move around. Keep attaching the pieces of wire and just keep going with this process with the biggest outline of your contour drawing. Once you have all of that done, we will start working on step two where we will use a thinner wire to create more of the details of our image. So for example, the nose, the eyes, the eyebrows, the mouth, and even the highlights in the hair.